the new Asus AX6600 Zen Wi-Fi rated among the best mesh Wi-Fi systems for price to performance. This is Wi-Fi 6. I'm coming from the Netgear Orbeez. Here's my before and after speeds here. Uh, I'll go into why I like mesh, uh, but Wi-Fi 6, faster speeds all around, more channels, better for a busier home and more devices. And the coverage is just great. You can walk around the house, walk inside, outside. It just works. I did buy this secondhand to get a little better deal on it. So I paid about $400 out the door with tax. It was like $350 or so, or $360 out the door. And uh, here's the box. It looks great. Uh, I bought it from Amazon Warehouse. It's great. But I'll put a link to where you can grab these. And uh, in this video, we're going to go ahead and why I chose this particular model. Um, I already showed you the benefits, but I'll kind of run down some of the other benefits besides speed increases and then we'll go through a walkthrough on setting this up and why i like it so much you can read a lot of articles about what the best wi-fi 6 mesh system is now i need the mesh system because i have a multi uh, level house and it's quite wide and i want to be able to use wi-fi when i'm waiting in my car to leave my driveway when i come into my driveway when i'm in my backyard anywhere in my backyard and anywhere in my house and so the mesh system is really nice for that and all my smart devices it's just really easy to use and set up and i'm very happy with it i'm coming from the netgear orbeez and i just upgraded to the asus zen wi-fi ax xt8 i've heard that there's some faster ones out there like the google nest as well as the new netgear orbeez are a little faster but we're you know you'll see the speeds in this particular video here um, you'll notice it's also the number two pick from Tech Radar right here. Reasons to buy great Wi Fi, good security. We're going to talk about this in a second. Really nice to have. It is expensive and it is, I didn't know this, it's limited to two routers. I thought I saw a three pack though. So I don't know what the, yeah, see, there's a three pack. So I don't know what these guys are smoking right here. So here it is on Amazon. This is what I ordered the two pack in white. You can also order it in black or charcoal. And, um, this is really cool. The well, the easy setup right here, the AI Protection Pro, you'll see it in my video. It's lifetime for free. And so this is going to look for malicious activity on your network. It's going to look for malicious devices and packets. And so it's going to really help, especially those that just don't want to set their own security up. Really easy to do. Um, they're quite small. They're fast. And they're Wi-Fi 6. So as you get more Wi-Fi 6 devices like cell phones and things like that, you'll be able to take advantage of those uh, faster speeds. So this is what I was reading, and I'm not doing this myself, but AI Mesh supported mix and match Zen Wi-Fi with Air AI Mesh compatible routers to form a powerful and flexible whole home Wi-Fi system. So you, you can add multiple extensions onto this. My biggest beef with this particular item is just Asus in general. They're a brand that you can, like their phones, their laptops, this this these these devices here the routers they may they tend to have really really high performance for a decent price all things considered but their customer service is not great so just make sure you you give it a, a joy ride you really kind of work out the kinks because if something does go down wrong down the line you know you may not have as good of customer support but i can't say netgear's any better myself but just asus in general that's a common complaint you see with a lot of their items so as long as it's good from the factory you're good to go but you know you want to do a once over look over make sure both nodes are working and and you know no no issues right off the bat no overheating things like that so it's time to set this thing up i took some photos just to show you what acceptable condition was everything was pre-wrapped and still in the shrink wrap so i feel like i got a really good deal on a used product here it is next to my uh i use a uh, at&t fiber here it is uh there's my orby actually and then here are the two new uh asus i put them next to each other when you set them up one going to the router one with no LAN connection. They should turn blue. They're both blue there. They're ready for setup. That's what the app looks like in the Google Play Store. Not sure what it looks like in the iOS Store, but something similar. And uh, here I am booting it up on my phone. And uh, it says, welcome. Uh, make sure your Bluetooth is on. I just showed you how to turn on your Bluetooth. Press the little plus sign right there. It says setup. Click that little middle one, the Aces Zen Wi-Fi. That's what we're going to be setting up here. It's going to ask to use your uh, location settings. I went ahead and let it. And then it should find your Wi-Fi router here fairly easily there it is and it starts to connect this process takes quite a bit of time like five to ten minutes so give it some time to do that i'll fast forward here as it goes and um let you know that i also got a, a incredibly better coverage from my orbeez on this in case you're wondering ssid is the name of your um 
your your Wi-Fi network, and then a password. And you can set up a separate net Wi-Fi networks or one Wi-Fi network. But as I was saying, you get way better coverage with the Wi-Fi 6, way more distance. I would say a good 20% increase on the distance. So now it's setting it up, and right when it finishes setting up, it automatically goes into a optimization mode. And you can go ahead and skip that if you like, um, or just run it. Uh, what I did notice with mine is I could not find, it only found the one router. It, both routers weren't working or maybe because the routers were so close together, they cancel each other out. It wasn't until I moved the second router, the node, into another room and then plugged it in. And then you want to wait. Um, you should, should go from blue to blinking, blinking blue to solid white. First time I'm in the app here since it's been set up, I went ahead and enabled remote connection so my phone can talk with the router. And then I went ahead and updated the, the firmware. It'll ask you if you want to update it, as well as you can find that under settings in the lower right corner. Um, you can see my connections. You can see like I'm missing the node right here. You should have a second uh, Wi-Fi router shown here. Like I said, once you unplug it, playing with the family controls. And then here's that AI protection. And why I think this is such a great product is Netgear charges you for this product. And it's completely free for a lifetime with ASUS. So that's pretty cool. You got to read the policy here and agree, but it's that protection. So while I finish up here and you can see what kind of settings we have, it's what are the pros, super easy to set up. One of the best price to performance, the Netgear Orbeez are more expensive than this, the, the newer ones that are Wi-Fi 6. These are Wi-Fi 6 enabled. So as you get more smart devices and phones that can leverage it, it's going to be better connection. Um, they're, you know, the cons I see is only the, that it is a lot more expensive. You can get a, you might not need Wi-Fi 6. I think that's the biggest thing. You might just be able to get away with the older generation uh, mesh system and save yourself a ton of money. So I'll put a few links to both systems and, and some recommendations, but uh, so far so good, really easy to use. I haven't messed with any of the manual settings yet. I understand you probably can do that, you know, especially if you have a busy network around you. And then the big thing too is you still have to watch out for walls. Like I got a big concrete wall and no matter what router you have, it's just not gonna go through thick concrete like that. So really the router placement and the way your house is set up also plays a huge role in how these things perform. So keep an eye out for warranty and price. And there's a ton of used ones out there as well. But here's my before and afters. And, you know, like I said, as Wi-Fi 6 becomes more prevalent, it's nice to have and you're future proofing your home. So here's the conclusion. Don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll catch you on the next one.